What is an atom? What is it made of? An atom is often referred to as the building block of matter because all matter is composed of atoms. What is an atom? Atoms contain three subatomic particles. Protons are located in the nucleus, have a mass of one AMU, and a charge of plus one. Neutrons are also located in the nucleus, have the same mass as the protons, and have a charge of zero. Many people confuse neutrons and electrons and think that neutrons are negative because it starts with an N. Instead, think that neutrons are neutral with a charge of zero. Electrons are found outside the nucleus. The mass is 0.000055 AMU and the charge is negative one. One atomic mass unit is equal to 1.66 times 10 to the negative 27 kilograms. The nucleus is the center of the atom. It is composed of protons with a mass of 1 AMU and a charge of plus 1 and also neutrons that have a charge of zero and a mass of one AMU. Together, the protons and neutrons give the nucleus an overall positive charge. The protons and neutrons, when added, equal the nucleus mass in AMU. Outside the nucleus is the electron cloud. Electrons have a mass of 0 0.00055 AMU. That's only 0.055% of the mass of a proton or neutron. Therefore, this mass is so small compared to the mass in the nucleus that it is insignificant. Electrons do have mass but it is such a small percentage of the atom, scientists consider it to be approximately zero. Electrons have a negative one charge. This gives the outside of the atom an overall negative charge. The nucleus has most of the mass of the atom. The mass of the atom can be found by adding the number of protons plus the number of neutrons. The nucleus has a charge equal to the number of protons. The electron cloud has a charge equal to the negative number of electrons and a mass of essentially zero. The overall charge of the atom can be found by adding the number of protons minus the number of electrons. The overall mass can be considered as essentially the number of protons plus the number of neutrons because the electrons have such a small relative mass. Protons have a positive charge while electrons have a negative charge. Protons contribute significantly to the mass of the atom. Electrons do not. Protons are found inside the nucleus. Electrons reside outside the nucleus in the electron cloud. Protons determine the identity of the atom. All atoms of carbon have six protons. 
and all atoms with six protons are carbon. The electrons determine how atoms will react with other atoms and energy. Protons cannot be lost or gained without changing the identity of the element. This is possible in nuclear reactions only. It is not possible to change the number of protons in chemical or physical changes. Electrons can be lost or gained. The ratio of protons to electrons determines the charge on the atom. If there is a greater number of protons than electrons, the overall atom charge will be positive. However, if there is a smaller number of protons than electrons, the overall charge will be negative. Since the majority of the mass of the atom is contained in the nucleus, it's very dense. It has a large mass for its size. The electron cloud has a very low density. It takes up much more space, but with a much smaller mass.